Welcome back, everyone. Kremlin Archer here. Time for some more RimWorld royalty. So, it's been a few days since I recorded last because um, I recorded in batch last time. You know, like you do. Did we talk to these people? I'm pretty sure we did. Yeah, you're the war merchant. Yeah, I remember talking to you. I have uh, a little trouble remembering because I have streamed my RimWorld game over on stream in the meantime, so they get... Things get a little clouded. Where I stream, I've been playing this one on, oh great, a volcanic winter on top of regular winter. Um, I stream at uh, twitch.tv slash Um I do Rim RimWorld on Sundays at 3 p.m. Eastern Time. If you want to stop on by. It's great fun. Let's build another one of these. Hello, Yak. Dead body we gotta get rid of. Jake, what are you up to? You're doing that. Can you actually um haul these two bodies out of the way? I know you're a fancy noble now, but hopefully this isn't beneath you yet. You know what I'm gonna do I'm also gonna delete this. We have enough space to put this meat back in here now. In fact, bum, why don't you nope, you won't do hauling. Never mind. Jake, do you want to do this? Hey, my microelectronics is finally done. Okay, let's work on geothermal power. We're going to move this over. And then we're going to deconstruct this and make the microelectronics bench. Tis the plan. Tis, tis! Did you fail twice, or was that still the same message? How long do we, how long until we have, um, did I not block that in? I didn't lock that in. How long until the, our people come back to us? Six days ago, so we're basically halfway through. Some donkeys. Hello, donkey. Hello, donkey. It's a terrible Shrek. I should be ashamed of myself. But strangely, I'm not. Trade caravan's leaving. Careful of the traps. Bum, what are you upset about? Drowsy darkness. Awful bedroom. Awful bedroom. Awful? What's awful about it? Dirty. And it's ugly. It's kind of ugly. Okay. Somebody is wardening, right? 30%? Oh, 31 root stuff. Who cleans? It's a Casey job. Okay, that got done. Um, high-tech research bench. I don't have enough of the steels yet to steal some. Trying to find the easiest place to get steel. Whoop! Yes, yes. Plant's dying. I don't know why you didn't die earlier. Casey, what are you doing? You're gonna dig? Casey is literally the only person who can clean. <laughs> I need you to do some cleaning, Casey. Clean. Also, this doesn't need to be in the home zone. 
Or does anything outside this fence? Yeah, turn this off. There we go. Oh, one square there. Can you clean this room? He seems to be very upset about it, so. There we go, now it's neutral. Oh, let's re expand the stockpile here. Again, I, I think I said it already earlier in the series, but I keep bringing up this menu to check for uh, for Overhead Mountain, which is this color. Which, in fact, I should probably fill in this one spot here. Because Overhead Mountain within, like, 20 blocks of, of anything we've constructed can spawn bugs, and bugs are bad. One of the things I deal with the worst is uh, is bug infestations. I'm really bad with them. Pretty good with most other things in this game, but bug infestations just do not work for me. Twenty nine point two. So we're getting there. A little at a time. You have an eight? Okay. All right, your bench is done. So I suppose I should knock down cleaning again so that you go back to researching. Yeah, I don't have I don't have any place for that. 220 uh, 298, that should be enough. Let's um Let's floor this room. Closer to not being enough than I thought. So it's still too cold in there. Not too bad, though. Six point eight. So we got twelve point one point two movement. It's gonna be a long time before that person's on the team. Did they build this yet? Yes. Now that I know that that's there, I got very concerned about it. <laughs> How's our power holding up? Still okay during the day. This is gonna be our rec room, so I need to be. Recreating in it. Make a few more sculptures. Most notably, Bum needs a sculpture for his own room. I don't know if anyone's gonna hunt, but we're gonna give it a shot. Google what needs food. Hmm, what am I going to do with you? Oh, that was not the button I wanted. I'm going to let the boomalope eat. Don't want you starving to death, my friend. I the alpaca. I was like, what are you doing? Oh, this yak got itself killed. Nice. Free food.
Hopefully when this Boomlope wakes up, it goes and eats. It's gonna have to eat our meals, because... We don't have any... Non... Food related... Hey! Not you! You know what we can do, actually? For a while, what we can put the Boomlope on training. Is it actually anybody training? Yes, it's a Casey job. Okay. Um, animals? No. This. Don't go in here. Well, while she's training him, he'll get food. So it should be okay. What are you doing, friend? 25.6? Still slept in the cold. I forget where you can see that. Comfortable temperature? No, that's not, that's not it, though. There's some place in this person's information which tells you what their comfortable sleep level is. I don't remember where it is, though. Somewhere. Do you guys... I don't know why that went a little weird there. Nope, you don't have it. Alright. I guess we're over our mechanoid, our uh, fibrous mechanites, which is nice. Jake is dazing because he happened to be in darkness. <laughs> Went into the dark stockpile and dazed it up. It's okay. We'll forgive him. Nine point. So we got two and a half days. Day and a half. Whatever. It's spring, can't you tell? Look how spring-like it is. It's like spring-like in upstate New York. <laughs> hmm. A group of yaks, okay. Well, welcome aboard yaks. Yaks are untrainable. Huh. Did not know that. What's this? Extensive edifice. Mysterious message has arrived. It seems it was transmitted by machine pers pers um, a machine persona that refuses to name itself. The message asks you to build a very specific monument. I don't have enough steel for this. Ten days, though. Five by nine. It'll give us um, twelve glitter world medicine. Three hundred and fifty steel. Can we get three hundred and fifty steel relatively quickly? I mean, ten days is a long time in Rimworld. Sure, why not? What's the worst that can happen? Where are we going to put this mon monument? Let's put it, uh... Put it out here. I'm going to put it somewhere where I don't have to deal with it. Don't have to worry about it for a while. Okay, put it there. We're about to we're about to double our team as well soon as soon as the our friends get back. 
which should be relatively soon. Yeah, a little over a day. I don't know if it has if it's the beginning of day eleven or if it's at like all the way through day eleven. It's a question I don't know the answer to. Two thirty five, yeah. See that's almost all the steel we need already. Um I just realized what does this need? This needs it's granite, right? Yes, okay. I'm pretty sure it needs granite blocks. And then I was like, oh my god, do we not have any granite blocks? Jake is our constructor. That's why nothing is happening. Been in it a long time there, Jake. You want to snap out of it? This is a very long days that Jake's been in. Come on, Jake. Snap out of it. Hop, hop. Also, we need to bump up Casey's cleaning for a bit. Malnourished. How did that happen? Casey, you're falling down on the job. Hey, finally Jake's snapped out of it. Volcanic winter is really annoying. It honestly might make it hard for us to grow food this year. We'll see. Wake up, Jake. Got work to do. Visitors, tribe of Toxos. Some probably incredibly helpful. Hey, it's humps. In my 1.0 campaign, I had a, I had a, I had a humps that was like a, a MVP of the colony. Don't get, don't get snapped. this parka and yeah I don't need anything else from you thank you enjoy your parka all right when our friends come back they'll have nice rooms here although we don't actually have a we're gonna be down a room because we have a guest here it's the polite way of rephrasing it call us returned Nice. Welcome back, friends. Wonder if I wonder what would happen if I put if I put a bed in here. Is that gonna screw up the? Let's see if this screws up the uh, throne room. I 
the studio's just sleeping on the floor again. I suppose this is an easier way to, to test it, is to, to put a sleep spot in there. Doesn't look like they care. Hope you guys had a good time. I wonder what they did. Slept in the cold. Alright, let's turn this guy on. I really hope this doesn't turn out to be, like, a mechanoid trap. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna wait till they finish this, and then we're gonna build a new- another room here. Probably two rooms. But I want them to finish this first. Hey, it's got scar sarcophaguses as part of it. When people die, they can be part of this coffin. Be part of the sculpture. One more bit to do there, my friend. That's done. Pods arrive. Jump to location right there. Okay. Of course, now we have a lot more food requirements. That's a, and we've got animal starvation. I don't really want to do this, but we're probably going to have to. All right. Zone. Animals. You can eat our you can eat our meals, it's fine. Okay, so this is done. So that's fine. Um How do I wanna do this? Let's Let's do that. Round off this bit here. Solar flare. It's good to see that Jake... Yeah, Jake doesn't care that Mitsuya is sleeping in his... Um, in his throne room. That's good. All right, I need a machining table. Put that right there. It'd be nice to make some helmets. Obviously Jake can't wear one. Oh, hang on. Hey guys, he's hunting our dog for food. Why did you just let him walk past? Scratch, just scratch, okay. Cancel the rest of that for the moment. Want this mining done first. Alright, I'm going to stop here for today, and I'll see you guys next time. Thanks so much.